Good morning, and this is another food vlog by Justine. Woo! This food vlog is special because here in Japan, each prefectures have their own speciality. Here in Ibaraki, the speciality is nato. 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 From the word na to. Ano pa tong nato nato? Nato is made up of fermented soybean. Yon. So what happens is yung nato inababad siya, nilalagyan siya ng bacteria, Bacillus subtilis. Lalagay doon for ferment. Makikita niya iba yung chura niya, brownish na ganon. Nilang isa. Dalawa, tatlo, apat, lima. Oh. Limang test ng nato ang titigman ko ngayon. Okay? I've been here for more than two years na. Pero talaga kumakain ng nato kasi yung tsura niya. Uh, mm, hindi nga ako nakain ng okra eh. This is a perfect time para tikman ko kung ano ba talaga yung lasa nito. Meron akong binasa. How did this nato start? Sabi sa story, it happens daw between 1086 to 1088 AD. Ang nangyari lang talaga na, accidentally lang siyang nabuo. There was a samurai boiling beans. Eh, eto na! May atake na! Oh my God! Yung samurai! Pandalas yung samurai. Ang ginawa niya, binadat na naman niya lahat. So, binadat sa straw, lahat-lahat. And then, umalis na agad. A few days later, parang naalala. Aba, meron pala akong soybean. So, nang binuksan niya, habang... <gasps> Parang iba yung lasa nito ha. They discovered na it was fermented pala. Anyway, kinain pa rin nila. Gutom. Pinakita nila sa boss nila. Sarah, mukhang masarap to. So, ayun na. Pinakain nila. Apa, nagustuhan nila yung lasa. Eh, kung ako anong meron ng panahon nila. Eh, gustong gusto nila yung lasa. So, that is the history on how nato was formed. Nowadays, since na-isolate yung bacteria that is responsible for the fermentation of nato, mas mabilis na siyang ginagawa. So, nababad na lang siya, tapos nilalagyan ng bacteria, and it will just take a few days. So, so and dahil nga famous siya dito sa Japan, so maraming brands ng nato, okay? Hindi naman kamahala ng nato, just between 50 to 150 yen. Makikita niyo rin, iba-iba yung expiration date niya. Ano ba yung mga nato na binili ko? The first one that I bought is, ito, yan, sa 58 yen. Diba? Kulay pula. Mamaya kita titikman. This one is priced at 48 yen. So, medyo mura. Third one, 78 yen. Okay? The yellow one is priced at 88 yen. And the this one, 149 yen. So, why is there different prices of nato? Well, I think so. I mean, it is because of the source of soybean na ginamit nila and how it was manufactured. When you buy nato here, may kli lang yung shelf life niya. As in, pag binili mo, kailangan kainin mo agad bukas. I got, I really need nato. Kain ako bukas. So, kailangan ganun kabilis yung pagkain ng nato. Sabi ko nga, it's famous here dahil meron sila na itong mascot na si... Nebarukun. Nebarukun, Nebarukun. Meron silang mascot. So, ganun ka-famous ang nato dito. Nebaru! I'm going now to taste five kinds of nato. Cheapest one. And then, papunta tayo doon sa masamahal. Kasi sabi daw nila, itong S903, ito daw yung top tier. Okay. Parang Pokemon lang, may top tier. When you buy nato, it comes in packs of three. So, yan. Kaya tapos kailangan refrigerated siya. That I will base then sa number one, sa odor. Ang rank 1 to 5, 5 meaning yung matapang yung amoy, strong smell, and then number 2 is the taste. The 3 is the stickiness. So when you mix them, makikita nyo na para <clears throat> bakit gano? So coming from someone na hindi talaga kumakain ng nato. Mm, challenge din sa akin to, to try out different types of nato. So let's try this different types of nato. Music! The first one, the 48 yen nato. Bubuksan ko na siya. So, when you open the nato, you get packs of three. Pag dito pala parang matapang na yung amay niya. Ito. And then, pag binuksan mo siya, wow! Oh, mayroon siyang kit! So, it comes with, uh, so, it is, I think this is the soy sauce. Ayan. At saka, it's wasabi. So, imimix natin yan. So, let's try this one first. Oh my God, look at that. Kita mo yung stickiness niya. Oh my god, it's sticky! Ibuksan ko na ito, itong soy sauce. Tapos ibubuks ko dito. So, yay! Habang pinupour ko yung sauce, parang naano ko na eh, naamoy ko na eh. Parang, oh, this is something good! Yes! Yes, come on! Oh my god, sticky nga! Stickiness, I'll give this a 4. Kasi sticky siya. 
<laughs> the smell. Malakas ba eh? Four. <laughs> Ganda mo parang pinapaling ilong mo parang mm, mm. And now the taste. Mmm! It is good! And you taste the nato. May halo siya ng parang anghang. It's a little salty na mapait. Four. Ito. Uubusin ko ba ito? Well, apat pintit mo nito. Maalat siya, kaya kailangan meron siyang kanin. Pero hindi pa kasi ako nagsasaing eh. That is the white ones. I'm giving it the four odor, four stickiness, and the four for the taste. Nebarukun! Nebarukun! Kaya pala dalawa na lang ito. Yung isa pinakain ko lang sa front ko na isang araw. Malapit na talaga mag-expire. <laughs> Ganit ulit. Ooh. Tinatanggal ko palang madikit na ha. Five. <laughs> oh, medyo mas matapang yung smell niya. But I'm still giving it a four. Wow! Narinig yung... Narinig niya yan? Narinig na, narinig niya. Styrofoam. <laughs> Ito na, titikman ko na. Maalat to! Five for this taste. Ang lakas eh! Siguro dahil malapit na mag-expire. <laughs> Maalat ng pangalawa. Nebarukun! Nebarukun! Push! Ang hirap buksan. Alam mo yung pakakainin ka na. Pahirapan ka pa. <laughs> oh! Ooh. Oh, odor. Hindi siya kasing lakas ng previous one. Three. Three lang yung odor nito. It's like pagbukas ko para, eh, hey, meron ba? Hindi ko talaga siya naamoy. Pero, in stickiness, or, so, yan, no? Ooh. Ah! <laughs> para, pumasok sa ilong pa yun. Mmm! Hindi siya ganun kaalat like the previous one. So I'm giving the taste of this five. Five yung taste nito. Good, good. Oh my, this one is good. The third one is good. When I go home to the Philippines, ipapa ipapasalubong ko tayo. Boy, nato, kain. <laughs> one more. Mmm. Nebarukun, nebarukun. Wow. Uy, malapot din siya. I think this one is more malapot than the other two. More viscous. Ah. Compared to the other two. Yeah, nag nagka-clump siya. Makapit siya. I think I'll give this a 5. Smell? Hindi, hindi malakas yung smell nito like the other two. So I'll give this around 2. 2 for the smell. Yeah, hindi talaga siya maamo. As hindi mo ma-expect na nato to. Unless mag-buksan mo. Ah! Nato. Dito mo ako na. Hindi rin siya kasing alat. Nung first two ko na natikma. Pag-ubos ko to. Mm. Taste, I'll give it a 5. Nebarukun, nebarukun. This one is expensive. Kasi sabi nila, isa to sa mga top tier na nato. Ooh. Ooh. Hindi rin matapang yung may nito. I'll give this a 2. Hindi siya ganun ka viscous. Ayan o. Oh. I'll give this a 3. Ayan o. Oh. 3 lang siya o. Oh. Guys, pang lima ko na to. <laughs> this one is a little sweet. Matamis tong last one. Parang, parang nahihilo na ako. <laughs> Taste is 5. Kasi matamis siya. O, oh, ba? Nebarukun, nebarukun. Oh yeah, I've tasted five different brands of nato, and you will ask me, will I recommend nato? Mm, of course, of course, I will recommend eating nato. Which brand should I recommend? I recommend this one, which is priced at 88 yen. So the yellow one. Okay. Nebarukun, nebarukun. I hope you enjoyed my food vlog, and this is nato of the famous food here in Ibaraki. And I'll see you on my next food vlog. Annyeong! Ooh. Bye! Isang linggo na ito kakainin ko. Pigyan ko nga si Arby. Bye-bye! Bye-bye!
nagbabag ako. So, ay sige maraming CRT. Marami kang tayo magpupo. Kaya okay lang din. Oh my God! Alam mo, batang umihak. Hala ka dyan.